If you've been subscribed to my channel for the last month, you know that I posted a video called The Seven Worst Songs by Twin Pilots. And you probably also know if you've read the comments that people tried to crucify me. Which goes to show that they're not true Twin Elm Pilots fans because they don't remember the line from Lame Boy that says don't trust a perfect person and don't trust a song that's flawless. Yeah, it is possible to say that one Twin Elm Pilots song is worse than another one. What got people mad is the seven that I chose, particularly March to the Sea and Johnny Boy. If that makes you mad, you should probably go watch the video. Or don't and just live in blissful ignorance. But considering the impact that that had, I figured that I should probably do the equal and opposite video and talk about the seven best 21 pilot songs. So without further ado, here we go. I'm gonna begin by telling you what my runner-up songs were. These ones were really good, but not quite good enough, I thought, to be in the top seven. Uh, these were A Car Torch of Death, Isle of Flightless Birds, Anathema, Ruby, Goner, and Ride. Yeah, I mentioned Ruby, so you know that I'm a true 20 on Pilots fan. Such a true 20 on Pilots fan that I have a pirated copy of Regional at best. What? I'm a bigger 20 on Pilots fan than you. My number seven choice is Taxi Cab from Self Titled. It is this awesome, awesome metaphor where Tyler expresses something very dear and close to him, something he's not willing to express so explicitly in other songs. It's his faith, his picture of how his faith works and how he has his relationship with God. Usually it's a little bit more clouded in metaphor, but here it's like this very distinct, clear metaphor and it's powerful, it's not preachy. And the metaphor is really well constructed. The taxi cab with like the Trinity driving it is awesome. The music's great, the lyrics are good, particularly these lines. There they were, three men up front, all I saw were backs of heads, and then I asked, am I alive and well, or am I dreaming dead? The one turned around to say, we're driving toward the morning sun, where all your blood is washed away, and all you did will be undone. Awesome and so powerful. At number six is Kitchen Sink, and I love Kitchen Sink because of the message it conveys. Public schools and just the education system in general, I think uh, appreciates more STEM subjects uh, that are focused on science and math because that's how people get jobs, right? But art is so powerful. It's such a great way to understand yourself and to become a better person and to express yourself and to work through things. And Tyler's basically saying in Kitchen Sink, that's what you gotta do. Create something, become a creator, be responsible for putting something new into the world, and that will give you purpose and focus. So good. I don't think that the music is much to write home about, but I thought that the raps and the lyrics were just amazing. Particularly Zach Joseph's bridge, which my theory is that that bridge is so confusing and it almost makes no sense if you really look at the lyrics and think about it. I think that it's actually a kitchen sink itself. It's something that maybe only he will ever truly know the meaning of. How else do you explain the lines sending me straight to bending? me. Or better I am gambling man, better bet I am a gambling man I am. Yeah, that's a kitchen sink. If you're a true fan, you know what that means. Number five is Forest. It's powerful, it's an anthem, it's something that people can sing together at concerts. It's just so good. They like are in the forest at the concert. The song's like, I think it's partially a metaphor for a concert. It's so, so good. Down in the forest, we'll sing a chorus, hands held higher, we'll be on fire, singing songs that nobody wrote. The imagery, the words, it's beautiful. The music is incredible. It's a good song. At number four is Migraine from Vessel. This song has a really cool, a couple cool metaphors. First of all, waging wars behind my face and above my throat. That migraine, it's such a cool metaphor. And then you have the metaphor of the islands of violence where he's fighting the suicidal crazed lions. The raps are really, really good, and the imagery is on point. Oh my gosh, so powerful. And such a powerful way to give importance to our mental state. Twin Pilots has always been a great voice for acknowledging and working with and trying to fix your mental state, and Migraine is one of the best songs for that. At number three is Holding On To You, and I have to be completely honest, Holding On To You, I think I've cried tears listening to the song and thinking about it. It's helped me through some tough times, and honestly, when I'm feeling more emotional, I think it's actually my favorite song, but it's so, so powerful. And then you have that bridge about the speakers and the bumping the hearts that kind of calls the car radio, and you have these amazing, empowering verses that are all about how like, yeah, your mind is screwing with you, well, screw with it back, tell it what to do, it belongs to you. It's it's incredibly empowering. Fight it, take the pain, ignite it, tie a noose around your mind, loose enough to breathe fine and tie it to a tree, tell it you belong to me, this ain't a noose, this is a leash and I have news for you, you must obey me. 
that's incredible. Especially when you're feeling temptation or depression or anxiety, that is something that you can say to yourself. And I love how Tyler and Josh just give that to us as sort of like something we can use in our own lives. The second best 21 Pilots song is, I think, Trees from Vessel. This song is probably the most emotional song and it has so much to do with Tyler's very personal vulnerable state and his relationship with God. It's him looking into the trees and asking God, are you actually there? Do you actually exist? And if you are, why aren't you showing yourself to me? And it's him, I think, getting his most vulnerable, not necessarily with us, but with God and his relationship with God. And I think for that reason, Trees is so, so powerful. And if you've been to a 21 Pilots concert, you know that the moment when they play Trees is just one of the most incredible ones. I want to know you, I want to see, I want to say hello. And the final, the number one, the best 21 Pilots song ever in my humble opinion is Car Radio from Vessel. This song was the first one that I ever heard. It is incredibly powerful. The emotional change in what happens, like just the way his, his emotions get more intense from the beginning of the song to the end, it's so dynamic, it's so interesting, and the lyrics are like nothing I've ever heard before. It tells the story of Tyler getting his car radio stolen and having to deal with what is real, what he finds in his head, the thoughts that he has, because he doesn't have entertainment or music or something to listen to to distract him and so he has to think about what's going on and this has been such a wake-up call for me personally because I know that I use things like Netflix and music and other distractions to keep me from going deeper and becoming a better person and learning more about myself and helping other people entertainment it can be a good thing it can be very entertaining but car radio shows us how sometimes it can distract us from what's really important that alone wouldn't make it the best song but that combined with the emotion and the music just how catchy and awesome it is, how good the raps are, and how he connects that to his mental health and so many different aspects of his life and his spiritual health, his emotional health, so many different things makes this song incredibly powerful, incredibly deep, just deeper than like any song I've ever heard before. It's so, so good. It was the first 21 Pilot song that I ever heard and it's the reason that I am a fan man of the band. All right, I know you guys are gonna disagree with me. I know that you already have been disagreeing with me. I know you've all had like a a thousand mini heart attacks at this point. So I want you guys to go ahead and give me your list. What are your seven best 21 Pilot songs down below? I wanna hear your opinions and thoughts. Don't forget to subscribify, hit the little ding bell, cause you know my videos are awesome. And I want you guys, if you have the chance, watch these two videos. I promise you'll like them. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later.